hey friends how are you doing welcome here because you've come at the right time to enjoy this new video thanks for being here guys yes. well today we're going to ah uh, so let's make an awesome video right first we're going to unlock this device okay Suzuki we're going to unlock it for a company since the new version of iOS 16.7.10 appeared about two weeks ago and we're also going to take the opportunity to jailbreak this device this is an iPhone 8 device yeah 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 let's go to the first one to clear it for a company what do you need to unlock a company well first make sure it has the manual version of the os second you need internet connect to wi-fi make sure that if it has an icloud account you know the email and password check that the device is not blacklisted or reported because otherwise it will be difficult to get a signal from the company you want to use on the device right so as usual we'll go ahead and remove the tray like this this is to show that the device is locked so later we won't be told that we are cheating and that the device was already unlocked and that's why it worked goodbye no here we're not doing any of that we're going to do a real test if the device unlocks it already has the signal here as you can see it now has the latest iOS let's continue we should see the famous message about updated cards right uh, here it is the card won't come out you'll see there's no trick sorry if you hear a bit of noise but it's really hot and I don't want to suffer the heat and as you could see the device is locked okay here I have the R5 cloud card this brand of card works very well for unlocking all iPhone models from iPhone 5s iPhone 6 7 success iPhone 8 X and the newest models this card can unlock all those models I recommend you use this brand of card I don't know why many people are so obsessed and in love with MKSD Ultra it's really good but it's not suitable for unlocking all device models if you want to unlock all iPhone models in the description below the video I'll give you a link to a tutorial to unlock all iPhone models with Verdad R5 you can hit it right there so we're going to put the turbo scene on it as you can see I've already placed it now we're going to put the sinker on it let's go getting on target uh, we'll wait for the menu to appear look here it is and to unlock this model I'll use the following configuration option 3 traditional mode I'll use configuration 1 with no GSM load I'll choose the mobile carrier and I'll accept and with this the unlocking process will start Let's wait and see if it works. All right, we're going to turn off the Wi-Fi. As you can see, it's already unlocked, but we don't have internet. So for the internet, we have to go into settings, go to cellular network, and here in the options, we need to turn on data roaming. You can see that I've turned it on already and it has enabled what I wanted this is the cellular signal 
I turn it off here it deactivates it for me I turn it back on and there it is right so as you can see the signal is back up right let's check if it can browse the internet okay yes as you can see it browses the internet without any problem see no problem at all now we will test making a call let's see if the device Subscribe. allows us to make a call let's check the volume and here it is well the call center at the Sorry. end well hold on a second stop no 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 i'm on it as you can see it worked without any issues we did it with the uh, rsync cloud great now let's move on to the next stage of the video we don't need the rsync part anymore So let's put this over here to the side. And now we are going to focus on doing the jailbreak, right? So for that, you need a USB cable. A very good quality. You need a cable that's top notch, a very good internet connection, and you also need a Windows computer. very good quality from a good brand I recommend using a Dell brand with a minimum i core 3 processor many people like to use old computers that the kind Christopher Columbus brought when he came to conquer America so don't use that computer because it will give you problems for the jailbreak I will leave the program in a link in the video description below Eva, to download it we are going to connect our device I've already connected the USB cable okay now the next thing we are going to do is turn off the LAN on our computer this is the first thing we're going to do we're going to turn off the ANT Once we have turned it off, now we can go ahead and run the program to perform the jailbreak. Okay, wind train. The version that is working right now is version 2.0. If you use version 2.1, it will not allow you to perform the jailbreak. So you have to use 2.0. Okay, sure. We will find this as an administrator. Yes, this tutorial is valid for iOS 16.7.10 and also for iOS 17.6.1. Alright, so here what we have to do first is click fix driver as this will help repair the drivers needed for our computer's USB port. Ready? The next thing we're going to do is we're going to give a press asset. One important thing to note is that for the iPhone 8, iPhone 8 Plus, iPhone X or devices with an A11 processor you don't need to activate any security method neither before during nor after the jailbreak you can activate those security methods neither those ID nor face ID nor the screen code can be used because the jailbreak won't work right you know don't do it before during or after because it won't work okay so you have to remove it well here I go press the volume down and power buttons to perform this procedure here that will tell us which keys to use the uh, ones we need to hold down 
Well, it was... It's late. I'm going to release the power button and keep the volume button pressed down. We leave this here still. We wait for the program to do its job. Let's go. And there it goes, right? There goes the jailbreak exploit. Yes, and done. It says here it's already done. Let's click here on the tool don't and let's go ahead. We need to remove Let's close this. the tool. Let's wait for the Palorin icon to appear. Here it is. Disconnected. A USB cable because I don't need it anymore and I'm going to enter into the Palorin. You can install Cilio or Zebra. I'm going to install Cilio. Let's install it and wait for it to download. What it is? The, the show. Yes, and once after that, it asks us to set a password. You can set any password you want. You can even customize right here. Okay, here is the cylinder. Let's open it. We say not to send us notifications unless with permission. What are we going to do? Hugs. Bye. Let's go here to... Freeze. We're going to update all the packages. Confirm it ready. Now we write it. And now to make the sure everything is okay, we're going to enter the pilot ring go to actions and restart the team sprint sprint perfect it's here as you can see the Silim here is working the palerine is still working and we did it on the latest version apple released for these devices ios 16.7.10 Important things you need to know, if the device turns off, you have to redo the jailbreak method, right? Right now, well, what looks new is the account removal, right? With the bypass, the tools that came out are for changing the serial numbers of the devices and removing the account. That's the latest thing that has come up right now. and. Also, the prices seem to have increased a bit because now there's a bit more work involved in this. Well guys, that's all for today. Thanks for watching this video. See you. Take care. Until next time. Bye.